Smooth moves, mastering the formation of adverbs from adjectives. Hello everyone. Today we're going to take a fascinating journey into the world of English language grammar. Our mission? To become experts in forming adverbs from adjectives. By the end of this video, you'll have the ability to smoothly transform adjectives into adverbs, enhancing your sentence structure and your overall communication skills. Let's dive right in. Before we delve into the process of forming adverbs from adjectives, let's first refresh our memory about what these two types of words are. Adjectives are words that describe or modify other words, typically nouns or pronouns. They give more information about things like size, color, number, and type. Adverbs, on the other hand, modify verbs, adjectives, or other adverbs. They tell us how, when, where, and to what extent something happens. Now, to the heart of the matter, how to form adverbs from adjectives. The most common way to do this is by adding the suffix li to an adjective. For instance, the adjective quick becomes quickly. The adjective happy becomes happily, and easy, becomes, easily. However, there are some exceptions. Not all adjectives follow the li rule. For example, good becomes well, not goodly. And there are also flat adverbs or adverbs that look exactly like their adjective counterparts, like hard, fast, and right. The best way to learn is by doing, so let's get some practice in. Exercise 1. Transform the following adjectives into adverbs. Calm, loud, sharp, gentle, direct. Exercise 2. Use the adverbs formed in exercise 1 in a sentence. Remember, adverbs modify verbs, adjectives, or other adverbs. Take your time with these exercises. And don't worry if you make mistakes. That's all part of the learning process. There you have it. A straightforward guide to forming adverbs from adjectives in English. Remember, the key to mastery is practice. So don't hesitate to create more exercises for yourself using different adjectives. We hope this video has been useful and we look forward to seeing you next time as we continue to explore the intricacies of English grammar. Happy learning!